Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Jukes222. Welcome back to another video. We're back at the Coach Squad, ranked 99. Um, so, I, I don't know, because we won last match against the rank 58 league, but we're down a bunch of ranks. Um, basically, we're almost out of the top 100, which isn't great, but um, we're going to hopefully get on a win streak and, and sort of get back into the rank 90 sort of range. Um, we're against Kek Ozrika. Gangbang, rank 300. Gonna play uh, this guy right here, Kronos 1984. So it looks like we are playing, if the numbers are right, um, a 30, 34 year old. So a bit of an age difference there, but uh, in the Madden world, it doesn't really matter. Well, let's just hop into the drives and see if we can uh, put up a good score against him. So he is a 124 defense. I'm a 124 offense. So we're even matchup. Patriots are a 3 4 team. And this is a regular stadium. So luckily, no muff kicks today. But he has good kick power. And we're up just past the 10. Going to start at Trips Corner Strike here. Counter formation, nickel zone. And also, we get this shift from Shazier and Newman. The read here is going to be uh, your slot receiver here. No, your slot receiver, Jerry Rice. On the little drag route. And we just barely get it off. Hit that 15% counter. Second and 10. We will go with empty trip shallow cross here. Or three zone. The read here is going to be Lynch. When he goes on the drag route. It's a really good play. But it's uh, often countered a lot. But against cupcake leagues. Um, it's it's pretty good. So we'll go trips 10. PA deep attack. Dime man. Going to look to hit wide receiver 1. Pretty straightforward play to run here. Again, it's countered a lot. Um, and also, um, that play cannot break counters. You'll just get sacked, which is probably the biggest downside of deep attack. But we're going to go weak IPA post. 3-4 man coverage. We're going to look to scramble to the right side here. And we are going to set up a second and short. Second and two here. Let's go with flipped spread FL drag. And we get counter formation when we get this dime zone. Um, the only, uh, I said this in another video, but the only reason, or the only counter coverage uh, that's actually not countered is when you're in a third and long situation. So we know this is countered. Low and medium, we're going to look to Graham when he breaks on his out route. And criticals, we're just going to try to gun it to Graham and get the ball away. So high snap critical, 4%, nothing we can do. Third and seven. Um, my thinking spread saw flags maybe as Trips Corner Strike was open, but it's not third and long. Motion Cross is a good bet here. Ooh, this is a really weird coverage. Like a really weird coverage. But it is man coverage. Never seen this before. Hopefully, uh, Wagner will engage with Newman here if he blitzes. And Sheriff will, um, will engage with Reader, but we'll see what happens. Yep, looks like we are all good. That was a really weird setup, but it is good enough for a first down. I'm going to go right back into empty trip shell cross here. Dime man, as we see uh, Roquan Smith here, do a little run and a step there. And you guys know the read. We're just going to hit Lynch here. Easy. And we are up just outside of goal line. We can go trips tight and pee deep attack. So that is what we are going to do. Dime zone, but we get the shift from Shazier, so it's not countered. We're going to look to our wide receiver one when he goes on the drag. And we are in for the first touchdown. Unfortunately, we did use our scramble all motion cross, which means we're going to go toss. This is open. And Lynch has just enough speed to get around the edge for the two-point conversion. So we're going to hop into drive number two here. Again, good kick power. And just outside the 10. Again, so we're going to go trips corner strike, get a 4-3 zone coverage. 
we're going to watch Sherman right here. If he drops deep, we're going to go to the slot receiver in the flat route over there. And if he drops shallow, we're going to hit wide receiver one on the corner out there. So he dropped shallow. So we're going to get the corner ball. Evans is open. We're up for first down. Deep attack here. Dime man. As we saw Shaquem Griffin do a little run there. Um, read here. Wide receiver one. Drag route. It's in like 80% of my videos. We get out of bounds. Should have hit him with a bigger, or should have hit him with a bullet there. But anyway, we will go spread FL drag. Get a 3-4 man coverage. Going to look to Graham here on the out route. We get a big super win there. Sets up a first down where we're going to go weak guy PA post here. 3-4 zone, so possibly countered. Uh, before it was 3-4 man, so that's why it was open. But the Patriots are a 3-4 team, so this might be a regular coverage. We're going to look to scramble to the right side either way. So it looks like we're not countered. We get a big block from Evans, and we're in for the second touchdown. Since we did not use scramble, we are going to go bunch spacing here, possibly countered. Yep, countered. Unfortunately, our running back uh, blocks the wrong guy there. And we do not have anywhere to go. Going to hop into the final drive here. And we'll start it off the way we start off the other two drives. On trip score and strike, a 3-4 zone here. Same reads, wide receiver one and the slot. Going to watch his cornerback here. He drops, oh, it's actually a man coverage, but um, one of the other cornerbacks dropped deep. Rice was open, so we just took that second and one. Spread FL drag, 3-4 man coverage. Going to look to Graham again on his out route. We get green bar drop there, but we do have shallow cross open. Dime zone is potentially countered, but we're going to look to winch uh, on any coverage, whether it be countered, a low counter, a medium counter, or a critical counter. So it looks like we are uncountered as our right tackle got the pancake. We're up for our first down, going to go deep attack. Dime zone, we get the shift though, so this is not countered. Hitting wide receiver one. We're just moving along. Going to move into PA post. 3-4 zone. Again, possibly countered. But Patriots are a 3-4 team. Not countered. We're taking the free scramble. We are going to slide right here. We can go back to Trips corner strike. We got man coverage here. It looks like a blitz coverage. Um, but since nobody came down, this actually means we're actually going to have time to hit our slot receiver uh, on the flat route, and it will be and we'll be good to go. So you'll just see the read here. Actually, changed my mind there. Safety was coming down, and we just went to our usual blitz read, which is the wide receiver two on his curl route. I don't really feel like um, recycling spread FL drag there. This, this league doesn't counter anything, so we'll be fine running PA slide, 3-4 zone. Going to look to either the tight end or the fullback here. You guys know the routes. We are up in goal line. Going to go with weak guy deep curls. Hitting the tight end on the slant. We are in for the final touchdown. Bunch spacing here, 4-3 zone. We are in for the final two-point conversion. Gives us 22 on the day. Definitely a good day. Pretty easy match. Pretty easy defense as well. We can check out our plays here. Trips corner strike. Shallow cross, deep attack, PA post, FL dragon, and the motion cross. That was a really weird coverage. Then we're just recycling in for the touchdown. And using more of the same. Got the PA post banger. And then we are just using more plays. Tested PA slide there. But anyway... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to comment. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit the notification icon to see more of my shakes, 22s, and three touchdown performances. But anyways, my name is Jukes222. Have a great 
Thursday night. Take care.